hello and welcome to my channel today i'll show you how to make this beautiful christmas ball ornament it's again two pieces um, spliced together I just want to show you how it looks like from every angle. So anyway, <clears throat> let's start it. Starting with the uh, slip knot. And we chain eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Slip stitch Okay Okay, now make that nice circle there Okay, chain two Yarn over, going through once, yarn over, going through once, now we have three, going through them all, chain five, yarn over, going once, yarn over, Going twice, yarn over, going three times, and now through them all, and again, chain five, so it looks like this, I have it here, the way we ending it, and we having one, two, three, four, five, six of those. And now I chain two, yarn over once. Getting on the top of it. Right here somewhere. I like to pick up two strings, but anyway. One probably gonna work as well. And so this way. We got right there in the middle. Whoops. <laughs> I always pull on that thing. Okay. So we have this. Chain one. Kind of so we have that beginning. Whoops. That's the right size right here. And now we chain seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And we're going from here to here, making a single crochet. Chain seven. And making a single crochet. And that's how we go all around. And because I already have this one right here finished, which I'd rather, if I have more, but I didn't do it. Well, that's okay. So, we slip stitch right here in the first chain. Now we chain one, 
and you again have a one two three four five six of those and now we're making a single crochet so we go right here making a single crochet one two three four five six seven and eight and we're making a single crochet on the top of the single crochet below so we make one more single crochet right there and again inside we make eight single crochet so one two three four five six seven and eight and a single crochet on the top of the single crochet okay one two three four five six seven and eight and a single crochet on the top of the single crochet so when you finish up the circle slip stitch right here okay slip stitch at right there which brings me on the top of here and I have to do it this one like this because I didn't pre-work like I usually do. So anyway, you're on the top of it here on a single crochet. You chain three plus three for spacing. Yarn over. You skip two, one, two, going into the third one. Okay, chain three. Skip two, one, two, going into the third one. Chain three. One, two, three. Chain three. one two and three chain three one two and three chain three going into the third one one two and three one two three one two three one two and three one two and three We need to have 18 double crochets, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. You have to have 18, 18 of a double crochet, okay? We are right here. 18 double crochet, making that, okay. So again, when you finish up the circle, you slip stitch one, two, three, 
slip stitch goes right on the third one. Okay, so you end up right here, which is for me being right here. You chain three. yarn over and make two more double crochet in the same spot so this is two and three okay chain three you skip this one going here and making a single crochet chain three We skip this double crochet going into this double crochet and making three double crochet. So one, two, and three. Chain five and making three more more a double crochet in the same spot so this is one two and three okay chain three skip here go here chain three Skip this one, going into the this one, double crochet, and we're making the same thing. So it looks like that so far, which I have it done right here. Okay, so we have a one, two three four five and ending up with the six as you remember we started with the three double crochet so i made up a three more double crochet in the same spot and now we need to do chain five two three four five and we ending up on the top of the third chain slip stitch chain three going into the next double crochet below and making a double crochet and in this double crochet we making two double crochet so one more time so we have four double crochets now we chain three coming here and making two double crochets and then single double crochets so we end up with the four double crochets like that chain one double crochet chain one Double crochet, chain one, double crochet, chain one, double crochet, chain one, and one more double crochet. So we have five, one, two, three, four, five, chain one.
and we're making a four double crochets right here so you can choose you want to make two double crochets here or two double crochets there it doesn't really matter i'm making one and two in the same spot and then three and four okay chain three and we do the same thing right here okay which i have it already pre-made so it looks like that four double crochets chain one double crochet chain one double crochet we have five of those then you have a chain four i mean ch uh, four double crochets then you chain three four double crochets five double crochets with the one chain between and it just goes like that so we ending it up by slip stitch okay so we have a five a one two three four five we need a chain one first and then slip stitch on the top of the double crochet okay so now we do one two and we're making four double crochets so that's two three and four okay and we make we jump here go right here and make another four double crochets three and four chain three look like that now chain four one two three four okay we're going into the second chain or third chain either way you want to think on it we have one chain below and we're making a peacock and then you chain one more so you have a one chain here one chain there going and making it a double crochet about the double crochet Below. so it looks like that and again chain four making that going into the second chain and making a peacock chain one okay so we're going into the this one I think I forgot to put chain one between. Oh well, chain four, two, three, four. Making peacock, chain one. okay so we have a four peacocks one two three four okay 
Now we chain three. Yarn over and we're getting into those four double crochet below and we're making a four double crochets. One, two, three, and four. Okay, from here we jump here making four double crochets. Okay, so it looks like that. And I have it right here. And we are in the end of it. So now we just chain three. One, two, three and a slip stitch on the top of chain three okay so it should look like this okay we have two more rows to go so chain two now we're doing a half stitches all eight half stitches so we have one two three four five Six, seven, and eight. And throw them all. Chain five. Yarn over. Double crochet. <clears throat> chain four and we do those peacock again so going into the second chain chain one and we kind of do the same thing okay chain four Did the peacock chain one and we're making another double crochet chain four and the peacock and chain one. peacock chain one and double crochet 
So we have a one, two, three, and four peacock. So now we chain five. One, two, three, four, and five. <clears throat> and now we're doing those half stitches. So one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. And now throw them all and chain five. Double crochet. Okay, so so far it looks like this. It's getting shaped. Anyway, I have made two of those so this is with the last row and this one is exactly what we just did so i have all this done we get to the point when we need to chain five but we're not going to do it yarn over three times Go inside right here. And we go once, twice, and three times, and one more time. Okay, so we actually have, you know, like we chain five right there. So now what do we do? Chain three, one, two, three, yarn over and make one more double crochet. Okay, so we have a two double crochets, chain five. Yarn over. And we're making two double crochets right here. So once and twice. Two double crochets. This looks like that. And again, we chain five, two, three, four, five. And making two double crochets on top of the double crochet below. Okay, see it? So again, chain five, one, two, three, four, five, and a double, two double, two double crochets right here. One and two. And then chain, chain five again, and so on and so on. So see how it's gonna kind of start shaping up, which is actually, actually the last, um row that means when you finishing it up you just chain five and you slip stitch on the top of the chain three and that's gonna be your um last row but because um the second one you just you're gonna start the same way you make two double crochets chain five two double crochets but now you now you chain only two or 
if you want to you can chain three and then you take this one just make sure wrong side again wrong side so you know we skip this one and we right here so that's exactly what we have to go to in here and make a single crochet or slip stitch one two one oh my goodness one two three okay coming right back and you're making two double crochets right here so this is one two chain three okay going back and we single crochet in the next one chain three one two and and three coming back making two double crochets one and two chain three chain three and going back making two chain three chain three okay I want to get to this point right here so you know how to finish this part so you chain I mean you make two double crochets then you chain five one two three four five yarn over you skip this part and you're going in here and you make two double crochet okay chain three see we skip this one because it's about this one and see how we're gonna hook it up okay so we we skipping this part and we going into here and chain three and coming and make two double crochet here and now I, i'll show you how it look like after i make two double crochet so one and two okay so let's spread so you can see it so that's where those five chain goes like I skipped it in in the beginning and now now we kind of like skipping it right here you have an opening but then when you go into those little ones you're working it with the chaining three which creates this part right here with those cute um bumps or peacock or whatever I 
mention it. So you see, you have the three opening in here because we jumping through it. Okay, you're working it this way, not this way. Okay. So I'm hoping um, you like it and that it's not gonna be too difficult for you to finish it. I always say, if you can make it, fake it. <laughs> uh, uh, it seems like most of the time I'm faking it big time. So you might do it too. I mean, you're still gonna come up with the beautiful work, even when you skip stitch here or there. Um, in the end, you know, it's, it's, it's just gonna come awesome. So anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you like today tutorial and most of it, you know, the work we've been working on, our, our Christmas ornament we've been working on. I think it's, it's really, really unique looking, lacy looking. Um, and then you're gonna do it. Make me happy. <laughs> okay, well, anyway. Um, the next tutorial, um, uh, it's gonna be easy one. It's gonna be a Christmas ornament just with the three row or two row. I don't even know, two or three. So it's gonna be real, real, really easy. And so we're gonna be taking a little break. I'm just waiting for it to harden so I can take off the um, um, balloon off so you can see like on this one how it's look like. So anyway, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for your nice um, comments. I really do appreciate it, every one of you. And um, I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Crocheting time. Bye-bye.